did you see uh, Carlos today? You know, he came out of the gates really as good as we've seen him. Um, just had a real good rhythm and um, thought he had a good feel for all of his pitches. And then, you know, just a kind of uh, kind of grinding a couple of bats on him, making him pay. Is that kind of a challenge when you're dealing with a Cubs team like this, that their lineup is just kind of from almost top to bottom no matter what? Yeah, they got a good lineup. Yeah, got to uh, got to make good pitches all the way through. Is Diaz okay? Yes. Yeah, just get him out. How much you like Waka? Stuff looked good. You know, this is a team that he's had trouble with in the past, and it was going to be a tough assignment for him, jumping right in against them. But uh, stuff itself, the life, the angle, um, Bite on the changeup ball that looked good. Had a couple good strikeouts, um, but uh, you know, got a couple other pitches. I didn't see where they were. I haven't seen the replays, but guys got more of the plate than what he wanted. We head to San Francisco now. What must happen for your team to compete on the road with a good team like the Giants? One at a time. Go play good baseball. That's it. All the way through. The rest of the way. Home oh, runs uh, haven't you know been a problem for Martinez this season, you know, was there something in particular today or was the ball just carrying well? I mean, those balls were hit. I mean, uh, it's going to happen from time to time when you have that kind of velocity and guys are uh, going to sit on a particular pitch. I mean, he was pretty hard to predict today, but if you know, good hitters will figure out a way to, to put a good at bat together and maybe sit and, and ambush a certain pitch. But um, Taking some pretty good at bats, but he also he looked really good. I mean, it's just he's continuing to show the kind of stuff we need him to have. Um, there's times when you just don't get away with many mistakes. Do you carry more confidence with you on this trip, knowing that your road record has been so good? No, we just got it. Just it's the demand we have on ourselves to play good baseball all the time. Like I said, home road doesn't matter. I don't. I'm not like excited to leave. Um, we believe we can beat any team any night, no matter where we are, and we just have to play the right. You know, we got to we got to do all the little things right. We got to figure out ways to grind through at bats. I think that's one of our top priorities right now is figure out how to to get those kind of um, so just those tough fought at bats from top to bottom. That's uh, the kind of team that we can be, and then we'll jump up and surprise somebody with a long ball. But we got to grind through them, run into some good pitching too. So I mean that always makes it more difficult. Other than Lester's pitching, how important or surprising was his offense and his defense, really, too, today? Yeah. 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 Did everything he needed to do. You guys have run pretty successfully on him in the past. Has he gotten better at holding runners on, or what did you see in those? Yeah, games? I'd just like to have seen a little better leads and jumps. Um, I think we could have better both. Uh, you gotta, gotta push it a little bit more. But you didn't have a lot of guys on base to try very often, and the times we did, we got shut down. Did you see on the play at second base when he tagged his helmet, which wasn't on his head at the time? Did he come off the bag then, or what? Yeah, I don't know what they. You know, you can't even go out and get an explanation without getting tossed out of the game. So I don't know exactly what they saw, um, but it certainly looked like he was safe only because of a very good slide. I mean, the throw beat him, but uh, yeah, it seemed like he got his hand drawn back and then his right hand in. Uh, they must have seen something we didn't.